My name is Richard Craner, and I'm the uh, writer and director of Starleaf. I also play the quote-unquote creepy park ranger. Uh, the film is basically about two Marines who come back from Afghanistan. Uh, they both have PTSD, and one of them finds out about this legendary strain of marijuana growing up in the Olympic Mountains, uh, which, if you smoke it, uh, will cure you of your PTSD, whatever ailment you have. But the the other caveat to all this is that this marijuana is from outer space. It's extraterrestrial. Weed. So they go tromping off in search of it. Uh, when they find it, one of them steals it, and then all hell breaks loose. Uh, and then from there, uh, we get into a lot of really, I think, interesting takes on what weed, aliens, PTSD, and marijuana can all add up to. Man, can you see that line? Can you see the line? Like, what lines? Like, that line from the movie, man. <laughs> and, and walking the trails with the snakes and the snails. Checking the pines with evergreen crimes. Walking the trails with the snakes and the snails. Checking the pines for those evergreen crimes. Yeah, man, that's it, that's it, that's it. <laughs> Run off. Do you know what it means? I wanted to find a symbol that represented this, this gateway that it was in his own mind, you know, that he didn't even realize was there, and that it shows up at these critical moments. And I think life throws a lot of curveballs, and these symbols, for me, represent getting past the conscious mind. Dude, this ganja is out of this world. There's an owl in the film. Uh, I don't know if he, he, she shows up in one of those scenes, and that owl was sort of, I, I made him my spirit guide, because during a previous shoot, we were shooting this film called God Machine, it was a short film, and I was about to throw in the towel on that thing. It was so difficult to shoot. And, it sounds crazy, but I asked for a sign. I said, should I make this damn movie? You gotta give me a sign. And about 10 minutes later, this giant owl flew over everyone's head, and I was the only person who saw it, me and my girlfriend. And it's the size, it was the size of a 747. It was a 747 owl. It was just huge, and it didn't make a sound. And I was so blown away by that, that I thought, okay, that's my sign, right? Well, as I was making Starleaf, um, I had another one of those days. Actually, it was the day that my girlfriend said, we're gonna, we're gonna shut production down. She was the location manager. We had all this weed growing. and it was legal, but it was in her backyard. She had a kid. She was afraid of the federalities showing up. She said, we're shutting it down a day before we were gonna shoot. And I was just like, oh my God, what am I gonna do? And then this owl flies over my head again. I'm like, well, that owl is my, there he is. What's he trying to say? Well, it turned out that that day, later that day, the House of Representatives passed a law saying that they weren't gonna prosecute medical marijuana operations anymore. They wouldn't give money to the DA. I took that little, little, you know, blurb on Drudge Report or whatever I was reading. I said, "Look at this! Like, they're not, they're not going to shut us down. We're safe." Whew. So, you know, he became this owl became kind of like my, my little, my little sign, you know, my little uh, spirit animal. I get accused of having smoked a lot of pot to come up with the story. Uh, if you have been high, but I really wasn't high at all. You know, I pretty much, in fact, before I even made the film, I wasn't smoking marijuana. I hadn't smoked it since I was a kid. Cannabis has medicinal properties, right? It's not just some recreational time waster. Science has my back on this. Yeah, science, bitch. Mm. Can't give that one away. That one's, uh, that one's, well, take a little trip into the mountains and find out. That's what I recommend. <laughs> you will find a lot of strange things in these mountains, I guarantee you. If you, if you do find any star relief, let me know. Well, shalom, shalom, baby. Daddy, daddy.